I'm Marshall Ruffy, and we're back for Technicolor Ponies that have gender confusion issues. Stay away from me, Blob! Super Fighting Robot. Defaced Gollum. Well, no big deal. Here, have a kiss. Dive bomb that horde. I get it. The kiss symbol. Bam! Uh, it's funny. Oh, ha! Is this? No. It's good enough. Golems still take damage. Oh boy, twice you. So yeah, another ether. A button. Let's press the heck out of it. I wonder if that did anything. Those are the symbols on the rock. And those look like the littlest pet shop. Applejack! Howdy, Fluttershy! I see you brought Twy and Rainbow with you, too. What brings y'all around these parts? We've been looking all over for you. Pardon? Applejack, you've been missing for hours. Rarity's pretty worried about you, so she asked us to look for you while we were out on our adventure. Oh, it's rare sent you, huh? Shucks, I'm awful sorry about making y'all worry. I'm okay. I'm just sitting here in this peculiar dungeon type place. I am glad y'all showed up, though. What are you doing in here anyway, AJ? AJ has the rope that you can lasso the thing. Did your family and Rarity kick you out? Did you build this dungeon out of spite because everyone you love has kicked you out? Are you on the lam? 
You can tell me, AJ. I'm not a narc like Princess Sparkle over here. Dashy! I think you might be getting a little bit carried away with this. I'm just hungry for the truth. Whatever. There's nothing like that, Rainbow. I was just out delivering some apples to Pinky when I saw a couple of strange creatures and toads here this here dungeon. AJ, you don't have to lie, we're all friends here. Can we all agree to ignore her for a minute? No. I already managed to take care of the monsters in this room on my own, but well they blocked the entrance after I got here, so I couldn't leave. And I was getting mighty worried until you three showed up. Oh y'all big time. You were scared? Applejack, you're probably the bravest pony we know. Except for Rainbow Dash. Hey! What about me? I'm pretty brave too. That's the voice of a Rainbow Dash from now. Hey! What about me? I'm pretty brave too. Rainbow, the other day you almost had a panic attack after Mr. Snakey P. Snakington Esquire snuck up on you in my cottage. That was just this, that was just one time. It happened 37 times this year. I want to recount. Twa? Have those two been like this the whole time y'all been out today? Pretty much. So AJ, wanna help us find out what's going on around here? We're looking for someone who should have some answers. Sounds good to me. Okay, great. Hey, lovebirds, Applejack is coming with us. Let's check out this dungeon. We are a car! Headset's getting away. Did I mute myself? You're like, yeah, you better mute yourself. You're a stupid idiot. Why you talk so loud, dum dum? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <sighs> Touch the cube. This cuby thing just kind of smells like pizza for some reason. Turtle power! Is this a door? That's one weird door. Whatever it is, it looks like it's blocking a path. I see something on the other side. I've been staring at that thing for a while now, trying to make heads or tails of it. Looks like and there's a picture of a key on it. I reckon we probably need to find some key. Some kind of key to get through. I bet there's a key somewhere else in here. Of course. A lock and a key system. That's much more interesting than a linear path. Why didn't I think of that? Let's bail before Twilight gets any other horrifying ideas. You there! Mobile mummy. I saw an enemy to prevent them from moving for three to five turns. Twenty percent chance of fail. Oh boy, twice I didn't look. What level is Applejack? Dex 8? Well, overkill, I just think. Yes! 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 A color wheel? Man, I will scorch the. frost the crap out of your color wheel. Add some cool colors to this bitch. Doge. Ha uh ha. -huh. Get it. Get it. Rainbow. Ha uh ha. -huh. Palette. Swap. Get it. It's fucking. Minor Whoa, 
and power of friendship. I've seen that in one of the coloring books I bought, so that's why I went straight to it. Actually, I wonder if I can go... Sh can I just not go down the door? Alright, let's try this key. Potatious! Four keys in total, I'm going to guess. One up here, and then two on the other side. Cactus? Cactus? No, it's not well. Fluttershy, heal that cactus. Fluttershy, use herbal cure. Okay. Don't do anything, Fluttershy. Just stand there. Oh, trippy. It's cacti or not? with Chavis's face on it. Here, I'll read it. <coughs> Meeting 3 p.m. The basics of our operation will be confer covered, including a summary of our enemy, the miniature threat. Attendance is mandatory. Uh, that was pretty good Javis impression. It hurts my throat if I talk like that for too long. Well, I reckon that meat will have the answers y'all are all looking for, huh? Hopefully. We better find that meeting. Give the itty bitty twinkie pinky. Woo! Fight that little pink dinosaur. Frost with the robot's weakness, fire with the robot's weakness. Burn me! I kicked so many things. Tubular. Mega Potion! Gotta cut your mom. Anti negativity helmet. The anti negativity helmet hurts your agility. Jump! I got a key. 
Bet the meeting's behind all the doors. Duh. So. A defaced bat. It is. I, I get it. They took the wings off Smug Bat and stuck it on a shrunk version of the faced robot. Go. Let's see what happened. This will kill the. My dogs are barking after that one. Well, I'll be. This game is lagged so hard. Remind me not to run into any enemies anymore. Bye. Relationship sinker. Chromatic classes. Quick. Kiss rainbow dash rainbow dash dive bomb that oh you like actually Dungeon is killing this game. It's like Power of friendship. What the hell hit me? He was down the stairs. He was two he was two entire thirty two pixel squares away from me. And he hits me. It's really, the, the game is going really slow, like I'm gonna press each key like two or three times to get it to move. That's weird, that's strange. I've never, it was doing great until right now. Like it's actually doing really well, and all of a sudden it just like, died. Okay.
hundred percent didn't level. Oh boy, pleasure. Heck, can we use some of those more relationship sinkers to break these couples up so I can pair them how I'd like to pair them? Cinnamon everything rad course Infatuation! Oh boy, pleasure! Oh, 
wasn't even a key in this room. Maybe I'm done with keys. Let's find out. Great, now we gotta explore more of this dungeon. There's no more we to rush through before I can see all the sights. Twy, are you feeling feverish? Let me see your forehead. You're acting awful strange today. What? No, I'm fine. I'm just excited about this wonderful hands-on learning experience. Learning experience? Twilight made Rainbow and me explore her... Uh, ...friendship dungeon that she built under Rainbow's house. You built another one of those darn things? Twy, I thought I told you never do anything like that again after you ruined my side of seven. AJ, are you telling us Twilight done that before? Darn tootin'. It wasn't even a fun adventure either. It was just a stray hall with a couple of wimpy monsters in the way. Just like the one under my house, Twilight. What the hell? Hey, the second one wasn't just a straight hall. I added that turn. Fleshlight, back me up here. Tell AJ how great that turn was. It sure was... turny. Shy, what are you doing? Don't compliment that hellhole. Oh, I meant to say, no, it wasn't turny. Fluttershy! Can we all just please stop arguing and get back to finding our way through this dungeon? Pretty please. Look, we already had, we already had an extra key. Let's use this to open the door and keep going. Oh! Oh, awesome. Oh lord, not another one. This is starting to make Twilight's dungeon look welcoming. We could always go back and take another trip through the basement dungeon. I mean, Applejack hasn't seen it yet. And I'd like to keep it that way. Fluttershy, you got the key? It's right here. Let's hope this is the last door we have to unlock. I'm starting to get worried. Babe, the last thing I'm going to do is let you get beat up in here. And I mean, I don't want Twilight or AJ to get hurt, of course. You're much higher priority. Because, well, you know, not that I wouldn't want to protect you if we were dating, if we weren't dating, but I mean, I think she gets the picture, Rainbow. Let's just open the door. No! Oh, look, it... It's this thing. What in tarnation? The last dungeon we got, lost in, had one of these things too. Must be some kind of... core. I guess. The previous dungeon just vanished when we accidentally broke the big flashy thing. Looks like my services are in need here. Once again. Hey, AJ, you wanna help me kick this thing? I know you're a big fan of kicking. You know me all too well, Rainbow. Let's get kicking. Yeah! Hold it, you two. Oh. We still haven't seen Javis in here. We should keep looking for him. Who's Javis? Just some guy we met. He was scary. He had a videotape for a head. Arden? We met him in a strange dungeon that he somehow created underneath the net. Looks sort of like this one, except not quite as impressive. Can we go back to the part about the videotape? We have reason to believe he's up to no good. So we, we have been looking for him. Phew! And I thought I'd been busy. Y'all found a whole nother cookie gun dungeon. <sighs> Y'all found a whole nother cookie dungeon for this one? And the creep who made it. Hey, let's not go jump into conclusions about the creepiness of dungeon designers now. No, please, let's jump to those conclusions. Let's just find Javis, okay? If the big glowy thing is in here, he must be nearby. <gasps> Fluttershy's right, and if Javis is evil after all, we need to be ready for a fight. I'm always ready for that. Let's go. Touch it, touch it, touch it. This must be the meeting we read about. The 
It's 2.59. Jabba should be here any second. Let's hide behind those big monsters and see what's going around on around here. Hello, my dear minions. Thank you for coming to this mandatory meeting. Wait, where is everyone? I could have sworn I had more troops stationed here. Perhaps I don't understand that I was serious about this meeting before being mandatory. I'll have to give them a stern talking to. No matter, let's begin anyway. It's come to my attention that some of you have absolutely no idea what you're doing, so today I'm going to explain some of the basics of our operation. We all need to be on the same page for this operation to be a success. First of all, I feel a summary of our target is in order. Our first target in this dimension is a floating archipelago known at locally as Equus Island. This dimension was selected when our scouts discovered two small dungeons built to the west. It appears that the locals have a habit of building dungeons, so ours shouldn't seem out of the ordinary to them. These islands have a low population, mostly comprised of ugly little horses. Such wretched little creatures, all of them are irresponsibly small. Just thinking about their reckless anatomy makes me shudder. However, their diminutive scale means they shouldn't pose a threat. To conquer these pathetic little horses, we've set up three scramblers in key locations around the region. One is here, in the Neon Labyrinth. You undoubtedly saw it on your way to this meeting. Our main scrambler is set up to the north, atop the tallest mountain on the island. Unfortunately, as some of you may have heard, there was recently a meltdown at our third location. Rest assured though, there is no need to panic. Two scramblers is more than enough for this operation, and the globals still have no idea we are here. Ah, 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 ah. If any locals do happen to find us, your job, as my troops, is to pummel them into oblivion by any means necessary. My job, on the other hand, is to use my scramblers to break this dimension down into its rawest form, so that once here, our master can reshape this dimension into a new kingdom to rule. And she'll just be so proud. Of me for what I did a great, 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 great job I've done this time. Yes, I know that many of you have heard rumors of my failures in other dimensions. Those operations were regrettable, to say the least. But this time is different. Everything is going perfectly. In a matter of matter of hours, I will be able to summon our master into this dimension at our main outpost. The locals don't even know we're here. It's wonderful! There's no way we could have a repeat of last time. Aha! I knew you were evil. You! Girls, what are you waiting for? Get up here already! How dare you use dungeons for evil! Twilight, enough of the dungeon thing. We've got worse things to worry about right now. Yeah! Ooh! <sighs> oh, yeah, like how this guy's really a videotape. I thought y'all were pulling my leg. I would one of you go about pulling the orange one's leg. You don't have hands. It's just an expression. Oh, of course. I knew that. Uh, uh, uh. Look, I thought I warned you not to bother me again. I'm terrible at following orders. Can we discuss your personal problems later? You're making me look silly in front of my troops. Oh, we are? Sorry. Javis, for your crimes against reality, I'm here by placing you for the rest. Oh, how cute. We're playing pretend now. No, I'm a real princess. I'm really arresting you right now. And what makes you think you can stop me? Oh, we're getting violent now, are we? Fluttershy, watch out. Watch out for what? For, uh, you know, kind of figured Javis would have attacked us by now. I suppose I'm not as violent as you assume I am. Well, never mind then. Rainbow, what was that all about? I was just keeping an eye out for you, like usual. Do you really think I couldn't dodge an attack without you warning me? Rainbow! You know, that really explains a lot. It feels like every time we run into anything dangerous, you just say you'll handle it. 
bait. I just want to make sure you don't get hurt. As if I'm the one we need to be worrying about. How many times this weekend have I had to keep you from getting yourself killed? Well, I mean, the thing is, you're, uh, I'm what? I'm trying to think of a nice way of saying you're fragile. Hold on. Are you two having fun over there? No, not at all. My girlfriend is mad at me for trying to keep her from dying, of all things. That's not the point, Rainbow. The point is, you don't have any faith in me. I'm just dead weight to you. Yes, break up time, break up time, break up time. Do you two think you could air out your dirty laundry after we save the world? Oh, so now you're worried about your clothes, too? You angry little pseudo-horses have the strangest priority. Sorry, everyone. I'd love to stay and see how this discussion ends, but I've got a lot to do today. However, let's look at this as a valuable learning experience. These two troops are going to show all of you how to take care of intruders. You're supposed to lose this one. That seems like to me. <laughs> hey, Princess Cadence! Let's just lose. I could just resurrect her, I'm not aware. If this isn't, so I just have to reload that save, skip through it, and start back out when the fight begins. No big deal. But I got to really test my voice acting. Not that I have any good voice acting, I was just having fun. Oh, you actually do lose, huh? That seemed overpowered, you know. Killed Twilight in one hit. For the very first move of the entire fight. But I guess I'll end this one here for now. My name's Marshall Ruffy. Thanks for watching.